Hello everyone and welcome back to Ender Lilies. So, we're battling Olaf again and I'm looking at my spirits if I can enhance something and I think I will go with either the Castle Maiden again or the Dark Executioner. Hmm, well this reduces the cooldown, but the cooldown is not that bad, but it also increases attack, but this also increases attack. And the wolf is quite strong, but... You know what, let's let's go with this. Let's go with the Dark Execution here. Because he does some work. And it's not that bad. Unfortunately, I don't have the Furious Blight I'm required to upgrade Faden. I'm about 20 short, if I recall the correct number. Okay, let's try Ulv again. Hmm, he seems to do quite a bit of damage. Okay, I was standing to close. Come on, come on. Need to remember he's really quick. Come on. And does two attacks. Faden's really nice. Okay, so the slash, the jumping slash is coming soon. Yeah. You do much damage like this. I don't want to use the meter now. I want to actually leave it for situation where I need to dodge because it does give iframes. Which is nice. Oh crap, I thought that was a different attack. Now I'm in trouble. Don't know why I forgot about that. Cheeky bastard. This is not my best run. Okay. That was close. Let me heal just in just in case. Um, we're not winning this one. I don't have any doubts about it. Okay. Um, I definitely don't like that. No, 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 no. Yeah, we're still some damage short, unfortunately. And I didn't have enough time to dodge that one. Okay, that seems to be a problem. But we were close. We were very close indeed. So this is looking better and better. Humanoid bosses seem to be very hard here. Well, Muriel wasn't humanoid, and she did give me some trouble, so... Yeah, there's always that. I just need to get some of those... ...tricks memorized. He does have those quick 1-2 attacks. That he seems to like. Come on, he's nearly down for the count the first time. Come on. That was unfortunate, I just ran into him, he didn't attack me. And that's one of the worst cases, because you get really dumb damage like this. Crap, that was even worse. And what will you do? Yeah, I kind of thought so. This gives a not a big window of opportunity to dodge, so if you're not ready for it, um, this will be problematic. Crap. Even more that. I was going to dodge in the last moment. Bastard. Okay, this won't be good. Okay, I'm not living through this 
Definitely not. He will be low on health. Yeah. Greed, I think. Mostly. I do have the pattern down, I just... Sometimes I'm just so greedy, you know, on these boss battles. Also, there's the fact that this game doesn't have a proper animation cancel. So, if you want to attack um, with a longer cast attack, like Faden or um, Elaine, and you happen to be too greedy, like me, you're in a bit of a trouble, you know? Because you can cancel that. There are times where you can, but it's not consistent, I think. Well, it is consistent to the manner it is fought. Um, but, um, for some reason you would expect that it would give you a chance to cancel that. Okay, that was, that was a good one. Dang, that was a good one. Um, yeah, and it doesn't work like that. Okay, okay. Okay, that was crap. Come on. That was also crap. Oh, come on, man. <sighs> well, again. With the tries. Dark Executioner is a nice spirit to have. Also, now that I see how Faden really shines in boss battles, I think I'll need to upgrade Faden still. Need to keep my proximity from him. I do tend to dash too much in and get damaged. Great. So this will be this phase. Nice, nice. Well, that was... not very... cash money of you, to be honest. Oh, crap. I would like to be close enough for an attack. Okay. Too much greed there. Okay, that was that was surprisingly good. Need to keep that in mind. Okay, no jumping there. Um the jumping is what gets me actually. Really? Really? And that was such a good parry, too. Okay, so you can parry that, but to be honest, I am more keen on the ground dash through that one. It did work good. But the thing is, I need to be an appropriate distance from him for that to work. And that's a bit of a problem, because he will trick me with the other attack. And that's a bit of a bummer. Come on, come on, jumping slash, shockwave attack, come on. Yeah. Okay, I also can squeeze an executioner through this one. I mean, after this one. Okay, he's mine now. Nice. Faden's a monster, you know. Come on, do your... Okay, that was quite lucky. Crap. You know what? I will heal through this one. And we're not in a good spot to dodge that, to be honest. Yeah. This will be bad. Okay, I thought it was going to be worse. Okay. 
That wasn't so bad. Okay, this one. Crap. And I'm all out of heals. This will be problematic. He is low on HP though. Ah. Come on. I don't know if the special attack is the way to go here, to be honest. Seems like a normal attack does more, to be honest. And I nearly had it. I just dodged the wrong way. Oh crap, I didn't, I don't know, honestly, I don't know why I dodged behind. You always dodge forward in this game. Yeah, that kind of, that was kind of frustrating. Also, yeah, I do think that, I mean, this is something I actually um, learned from a couple of previous bosses that a sure way to dodge here is to definitely not dodge backwards. Most attacks can be dodged through if you dodge forward. Dodging backwards only gets you outside of your iframe range and right into the attack. So that's something to keep in mind. Okay, that was too... Um, what I'm looking for the word too slow. Okay, he's nearly stunned also, so... That should be a good window of opportunity. I just need to... Okay, let me just... Okay, we'll do it like this. Get the special up for a iframe attack. Come on, we can do it. Yeah, and we've done it. Nice, 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 nice. Ooh, I'm quite, um, I'm quite uh, happy about this. This wasn't that bad. Another one. In love, and with a tragic end, I presume. At least that's what it seems. Let's see. The defense of the Bastion was the longest and the most grueling battle I've ever fought. We've staved off the blighted hordes, defended the kingdom, but none were left to thank us. Now we're trapped in our own undying shells, just like the blighted themselves. Sorry, I've dreamt of dying on the battlefield for so long. Now I'll never die at all. I see a field of flowers coating the snow-covered ground all around me. The white priestess was the one who told me what these flowers are called. All I'd ever known was battle. The priestess broadened my horizons considerably. I was never one for long conversations. I never really knew how to talk to people. She would have laughed as I struggled to speak, but never made me feel ashamed. Once the fighting has ended, we may never see one another again. Perhaps it would be better that way. Well... The priestess said she loved this field of flowers. I guess you're reunited again. If at any yet bloom, would it please her to gaze on them again with me someday? I think it would. Ulf the Mad Knight slashes, slashes twice with giant claws. Charging will unleash a series of gorging attacks and a devastating finisher, but leaves you wide open. Feared by his order and dubbed the Mad Knight, Ulf seemingly lost his edge after a fierce battle. He continued to protect the Snowflower Garden in seclusion. Oh? When facing a wall, the great claws of Mad Knight Ulf allow one to adhere to walls. Jumps can be performed after latching onto a wall. So, now we know how to get through those pesky walls. Yeah, just like that. So. 
This is what we were looking for. This opens a lot of what's left. The flowers you so carefully guarded. Polluted by the blight as they become. I find them beautiful all the same. Yeah, they are beautiful. And achievement unlock heroic death and achievement unlock truth. I kinda get of. I also have a problem with holding long conversations. All holding conversations at all. Okay. So he was protecting her. White priestess's bastion letter. The cold makes living here kind of hard, but it's much better than that gloomy laboratory. I've even made a friend. His name is Ulf. I'm not allowed to wander around, and I have to follow Julius's orders. I wonder if everyone else who escaped is well. I wish I could write letter, write them letters, so I guess I'll call this one practice. Okay, here is something weird, but we do find those priestesses along the way, those fallen priestesses, and I always thought that those were the previous priestesses, like, you know, the some previous um, girls, but her waking up in a laboratory and other such experiments kind of make me think that maybe not. Um, what if... What if they aren't exp um, what if they aren't other um, girls? What if they're just, you know, clones? Or something like that? Also, I want to see something. Crap. Let me just check one thing. Because there was this, yeah. This one, and if I remember correctly, there is also one here. Wolf's a pretty nice spirit. Huh, chain of sorcery. Nice, nice. Okay, we have this, but wasn't there also a... Yeah. This is what I was looking for. I drank the elixir the sorcerer gave me, and the rest is a blank. So you're gonna make me explore all those nook and crannies before you show me the way. That's quite cheeky of you. So not here. Is it here? Let's just see also here. Nope. Huh. Interesting. Either I'm looking at it wrong, but... Or maybe here... Yeah, I'm not looking wrong. Nice. I don't like these slimes. They're quite pesky as enemies. This is the SP gauge by one. Records the Reaper dances with the spirits on the battlefield. An old relic unearthed when the ancients were destroyed. Resistant to rust. So that gives me another level of charge. Like I can use two special attacks with it, or or not. 
because that was not quite clear to me after the description. But I guess we'll see in a moment. I actually have precisely one more slot to use. Also, maybe I will um, go with the... Um, we have a lot of damage, but I will try this. And this. Why not? Could prove a nice combo. Also, where was that wall? I couldn't... Was it here? It was definitely there. Sorry. Also, I think here I would have jumped and also there. Ah, so many places to see now. Let me just... Here would be the correct way, I think. We still need to find those stone tablets, though. We need a lot of them. I think we only have three, if I remember correctly. So that's still a long ways away. Yeah, you won't get me like that. Famous last words. Nice. Didn't need to eat my words. Hmm. Yeah, it's here. So let's see about that new claw climbing ability. And see how good it works. Oh, you bastard. It's... Ah, crap. So it won't allow me to go here. Still need something else, it appears. Or rather, maybe there is a secret somewhere? Doesn't appear so. Well, that sucks. So, definitely not this way. Let me just check something. Nah, it would be too easy, I think. But, but let me check, just in case. Hmm, doesn't seem to be. Okay, so... I guess no use in trying that. Hmm. That's a bummer. Yeah, I kinda didn't remember that it was a mm, angled wall. So I guess that makes the climbing there out of the question. That would enable me to climb in that abyss, if I remember correctly, but um, it's too damaging for us. I, if I recall, it did a lot of damage even even if I had the um, mask with me. Also, yeah, I do have another um, another gauge uh, of the special attack, so that's pretty nice. So, what's here? Because there is a red dot here. Bastards! Okay, one of those again. Crap, I thought I unlocked a lot, but it doesn't seem to be looking like this right now. Which is quite unfortunate. Just need to find the right place to unlock even more stuff, I guess. And what's there? Hmm, the quickest way would be... Well, basically the same, if I'm honest. 
I do remember this place, I mean the place where we need to get, but I don't recall why we didn't visit that dot. Hmm. That was pretty useful. I wonder how to get there. But that's another question. There was a spirit there. I mean, some blight. Crap, need to heal. Am I going the correct way? I was going the correct way, just... Messed it up. I wanna try something here. Okay. Not was not ah crap. Yeah, now it's unlocked. What is that? thing that I'm looking for here. Okay, so can we go through the middle? That's the question. And I think I messed it up. I think we can't. That's just a drop. Well, so I guess we're going like this. Kind of sucks. Oh, crap. Yeah, well, that did a lot for me. Um, okay. This is a bunch of time waste. A lot of time wasting. In my part, sorry about that. I thought I had the correct way, but apparently I did not. Also, why isn't that stuff opened? Why isn't this open? Do I need to... Oh, this is this place. Oh, crap. Now I know why I didn't go through here. Now I'm remembering those places, actually. That was quite lucky. Yeah. And that's why I didn't like going through here. Crap. Bastards. Okay, let's say we got through here relatively fast. And up we go. So this is the place where I wanted to get. But it worked as you saw. Let me just heal just in case. So I don't run into a one enemy and reset the whole run like that. I wonder if there's something here. Yeah, a whole bunch of dumb damage and trouble. That's what that what was here. Uh, let's just say it kind of worked. Hmm, I was here previously, so why didn't I go... Didn't have this? Probably. Well, an amulet fragment is always nice. Just that I think we have the maximum HP that we can have, even without bonuses, because I don't even see the bar moving. 
so maybe it is a good thing to have, but it doesn't give us much. I don't know why, what, what was the reason I didn't go here. But it, this looks more like a fluff room, when I find more diaries and letters. Oh. Priestess's castle memo. Why was I chosen by the king? Is it because I was the first white priestess born among my sisters? I wonder if my other siblings are still down below. All I can do is tidy up the room mother used to occupy. It will be ready for her when she returns. Or kinda no. Prayer Restoration Plus. Also, do they actually restore more now? Because I have a thing they restore the same amount for from some times now. Huh. Stagnant by 10. Always useful. Oh, I think this is how the Royal Ages meets its end. So those are the fallen um, Bastion Defenders. A lot of stagnant plights. Only 10 per, but that's always something. Maybe there will be... Hmm. That was my mistake. Kind of bad one at that. Yeah, that's what you get when you want to finish the fight quickly. But another spirit, I guess. I'm not done yet. The king. I must find the king. So, let's purify him. And see what he remembers. One-eyed royal ages. The giant knight thrusts his great sword into the ground, creating a shockwave that launches surrounding enemies into the air. Royal Ages Elite, tasked with protecting the king, defended the castle during the rain, only to be betrayed by one of his peers. Consumed by madness. Yep, yeah, betrayal. That's what gets you in the end, I guess. Even the toughest and the most brave knights fall to that. It's a lot of stagnant blight. Yeah, that seems like a slaughter room, right? Hey, nice. Secret? No, no secret. Shame. Oh. Oh, so we're here. Nice. Okay, so dealt with that. And let's go to the place of respite again. So I wonder where to go now. I could check the abyss, but as I said, it's highly damaging and the mask doesn't seem to work. I wonder about that. Also, we have something here. Let me check the recording time screen with Flicker. Whoa, well, we are way past time, so I will just teleport here, and I guess I will save, and we'll continue in the next one. It seems appropriate, we've done quite a lot in this episode, so thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, and bye-bye.